So I told you that I was going to do a review video for you as a bonus video, and I'm going to go ahead and review my set of, um, well, drawers, but it's called the Glam Box. And I got mine off of QVC, but they do have their own website, and um, I'm just guessing it's just glambox.com, but just go ahead and look up Glambox acrylic drawers and it'll come up. Um, so I'm going to kind of be halfway turned around and trying to look at you during the video, but I want to show you guys all of this so that if you've been looking for one of these, you get a good idea of what it consists of. I still have not taken it fully out of the plastic yet, even. So just to give you guys an idea, the bottom drawer is a really large drawer and I've got like most of well, I'm going to tell you what I have in it in another video, but just larger items like this First Aid Beauty um, Ultra Repair Cream, if you know how big those are. It has about another inch to go before it's filled up, so it's a pretty um, deep drawer. This one is the second deepest, and um, again, I love these pull knobs. I love a lot of things about this box exactly. I've been looking for at least three years and I was going to get the Muji boxes but then or the container store boxes but by the time I added all those up they were actually more than this one so I just ended up going with the glam box instead anyways. And then this drawer is as deep as that drawer but it does come with a couple separators so I have one right here that you probably couldn't see otherwise but I'm separating lip products right there from some cheek products. So these two are the same size drawers. These two. Um, these two. So you have the super deep one, two pretty deep ones. Um, let's see, just to show you, this is a blush um, up against the side. And that, there's about another good inch there. More than an inch. So again, that's a Tarte Amazonian Clay Blush, if you are familiar with the size of those. Then this is a skinnier drawer. And this also comes with an uh, extra piece. It comes with this um, big X that you can put together. So you just put one down and then you can put the other one and you can do it however you want in there. Um, you could do it like this or, you know, at an angle. So... I'm probably not going to get that back in here right now. Okay, I'll just put that back in after the video. And then this last top one actually has a lid that flips over. Um, obviously I have it down right now, but it's for anything that won't or fit or that you don't want to go in the drawers. So I have like some Formula X nail polish, a two-pack right here that I got, um, some tart brushes in the case right here, um, one of the Too Faced Christmas palettes back here just tucked in, um, and I'm hoping to get all my palettes up here on the top at some point, but it holds a lot. Like, this top one is is the most um, filled, I would say, and you can see how much is going on in there. So, um, I don't know that I can get the lid right now, but if all it is it is it's an acrylic lid anyways and then it just fills up like this extra space right here and if you want to close things up in here that's all the difference is but if you want to keep it open so that you can fit as tall of things as you want to um then you can do that and here's the little insignia i'm not sure if you can see that very well or if i can zoom in on that ah. Can't zoom in during a video, but the, it says Glam Box right here. So if you want to check them out, I would go ahead and do that. Um, if you've been looking for a really nice set of acrylic boxes, and again, I really love these handles. They're not like just a little thing that you have to put your finger in and pull. They're not just a little tiny crystal that you have to pull. They're just um, a full tubular acrylic handle. So. I very much like it. So I'm super happy with this product. I got it for Christmas. Like I said, I've been wanting one for years. It is a bit expensive, but if you get it for your birthday or for Christmas or something, um, I think it's a very good uh, gift to put on your list, especially if you're into makeup and a collector of makeup. And if you lay your stuff out, like this is my favorite drawer, if you lay your stuff out super pretty, um, it will just make you 
be reminded of what you have and maybe you'll spend less on going out and getting the same products over and over because you lose them, which is what I do. So hopefully I will be better in 2016 to keep track of my things now having this box. But um, that's everything for the glam box tutorial or glam box review, not tutorial. I didn't teach you how to make one of these. But I will do another video on what's inside my glam box and go through all of my products with you. But that will be a video in the future to come. And let me know if you're interested in that or any other videos for me to upload for you guys. And I will get to that. So I hope you're having a really good day and thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe below and always comment. Feel free to comment um, anything about this video or anything that you want to see or if you just want to talk to me. I'm always there. So thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye!